The tough task is winning at the Revs home park where they've only dropped a pallid one home game this season. A win gives the Union a clean sweep and a spot into the next round to face the top seed FC Cincinnati. From Gillette Stadium in Foxborough, Massachusetts, welcome to the 2023 MLS Cup playoffs. Tonight, it's game two of this first round Eastern Conference 4 5 matchup as the Philadelphia Union up 1 0 in the series visit the New England Revolution. We also respect and recognize it's a lot harder on the road, okay? We have to be willing to grind together. We have to be willing to suffer together. There's going to be hard moments. There's going to be great moments. But everybody has to stick together. All 11 guys are nice and compact. There's no better feeling than winning on the road together. But it's hard, okay? Last thing for me, if they want a street fight, I'll take this group in a street fight over anybody. So if it's about rolling up our sleeves, we're willing to do that. We always do our talking on the field, guys. That needs to be the case tonight. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. From the opening whistle, guys, whatever the game brings, be ready to fight. Team on three. One, two, three. Team. Both are the respective sides jogging and onto the pitch here on the turf at Gillette and getting set for the kickoff. about last game. This game, it's always about us, all right? Let's make sure we stay compact, we free the pressure, and let's not get stuck into stupid shit, all right? We play our game, our style, stay compact. We hit them on the transition, but we can also be patient in the buildup, all right? Let's go out there and win this game. Everybody together, let's go. Come on, boys. Come, on. Come on, win on three. One, two, three. Win. Sullivan in possession from Ua. He's in a 1v1 situation here. Motor goes way through with a deflection shot. Rolls wide to the left of Edwards Jr. No score. He will drive this cross and it's low. It goes through everybody. Davey Lowe at the six. Goes past Ua. Blocked down by Mark Anthony Kay. Rakes off the post from Nate Harriel. Put him in the Union's first penalty tonight on that third ball from Nate. All fired, still a scoreless game in the 27th minute. Went forward, the ball played over the top from Madoya. The two yet again not on the same page. One by Romney, spills out here for a throw for New England over to the left. And now Drew Fisher's actually gonna overrule the AR on the near side, Ian McKay. We're gonna see a red card. He's going to the back pocket, it's a red card to Mark Anthony Kay, who's done as he stepped on Daniel Gosdog. And a Mark moment of Anthony madness. Kay is out, and they're down the 10 men late in the first half. From 19 yards away, just outside the 18 from McGlynn. Shrugs his shoulders, ramps his forward, saved there by Edwards Jr. hungering the near post. Nice play by Edwards Jr. It didn't spill out. Nobody was home to tap in a rebound. Gustavo Ball with the back heel to Farrell with the chance, fires the shot, saved by Andre Blake, punts his balls in the air and says no, there's the brick wall, Blake, we know it love. One man wall constructed by Hill McGlynn goes right at goal, rolls it forward, and it goes in for the Union! 79th minute, 1-0 Union, out of a commanding lead at the edge of the game. And there's the final whistle for the third consecutive year. The Philadelphia Union move on to the conference semifinals. They win it one nothing tonight on the road in New England. Thanks to a Chris Donovan playoff goal and the fans of the Reds hit the exits.